What's up, everybody? Welcome to Watch With Jay. Today, I'm going to be watching um, Young Frankenstein and Fiddlestick and Happy October. I am, you know, this is like a, you know, I think October is one of my favorite um, months. But you know what's crazy is that I am terrified of scary movies. So I'm not really exactly sure what route this is going. But a lot of people actually wanted me to watch this one last year around the Halloween time. But I didn't end up having time to do so. Um because I wasn't that active but here I am and I am finally about to watch Young Frankenstein hopefully it's not too much or not scary because of I do not do well with scary movies but um you know like I said we are going to get through this and just to let you guys know if you do want to see the full watch along make sure you guys um click down below on my patreon okay um and, you know, just go ahead and sign, join up and, you know, you can basically watch the full watch along. I don't know why I feel like I can't talk like I'm like tongue-tied, like, blah, 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 I don't know. Anyways, I'm about to go ahead and get started. I'm not going to waste you guys' time no more. Make sure you guys subscribe if you do like the reaction. Oh, this is Mel Brooks. I know, what what movie did he do that I've seen? Gene Wilder. Young Frankenstein. Um... It had Gene Wilder in it. It was like a, it was like more funny. Wait, Gene Wilder in here too? Oh my, they must be close because he, Blazing Saddles. Blazing Saddles. I'm like, what the, he in here too? Them two must be close to something. Is that a casket? Oh yeah, that's a casket. Frankenstein. I know this might sound bad, but I don't know Frankenstein whole name. I just always knew Frankenstein, so that. <laughs> what is that? You gonna steal from a dead person? Well, that thing was not letting go. I would have just opened the box. I have one question, Dr. Frankenstein. Gene! Pronounced Frankenstein. But aren't you the grandson of the famous Dr. Victor Frankenstein who went into graveyards, dug up Frankenstein? Oh, so is he. And transformed dead components into. Yes! Yes! We all know what he did. I'd rather be remembered for my own small contributions to science and not because of my accidental relationship to a famous cuckoo. <laughs> Frankenstein? Oh, I said Frankenstein too. I'm not sure I understand the distinction between reflexive and voluntary nerve impulses. What they supposed to do with him? Mr. Hilltop, would you hop up on your feet and stand beside this table? Oh, boy. Nice hopping. <laughs> would you raise your left knee, please? You have just witnessed a voluntary nerve impulse. Reflex movements are those which are made independently of the will. <gasps> we are not aware of these impulses. Neither do we intend them to carry out... Oh, like, why did I help out with this? Why, you mother-grabbing bastard! As you can see, all communication is shut off. <laughs> oh, boy. You might want to take that thing off. We would collapse like a bunch of broccoli. Oh, 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 no, poor guy. He ain't volunteering again. Injury oh, to the nerve oh, root is always serious. Oh, boy. Darwin preserved a piece of vermicelli in a glass case. It actually began to move with a voluntary motion. But you have to remember that a worm, with very few exceptions, is not 
a human being. Wasn't that the whole basis of your grandfather's work, sir? The reanimation of dead tissue? Doesn't the bringing back to life what was once dead hold any intrigue for you? You have more chance of reanimating this scalpel than you have of mending a broken nervous system. But what about your grandfather's? Dude, just stop asking a question. I am not interested in death. The only thing that concerns me is the preservation of life. Oh my God, why did he do that? Oh, I know he had paid. Dismissed. Oh, yeah, I know he heard. I have traveled 5,000 miles to bring you the will of your great-grandfather. So, did I mean this young Frankenstein and not young Frankenstein? I'll count the hours that you're away. Oh, darling, so will I. Not on the lips. No! I don't want to smear my lipstick. Oh. You understand. Of course. Oh, boy. I'm yours, all of me. What else can I say? My sweet love. The hair, the hair. <laughs> you can't touch nothing. I prefer old-fashioned wedding night. <laughs> You're incorrigible. You love me? You bet your boots it does. Half of the darling. Oh, my God. No, the dress is taffeta. It wrinkles so easily. This is ridiculous. Girl, at this point, he might as well just stand away from you. Ah, the nails! Oh. oh, my God! Girl! Goodbye, darling. Goodbye, Freddie. Darling! <laughs> is she serious? What? What a joke. What the heck? Oh, uh-uh. Frankenstein. <laughs> You're putting me on. He wasn't even fret and face. He like, okay. Do you also say Froderick? No. Well, why isn't it? Frederick Frankenstein. It isn't. It's Frederick Frankenstein. You must be Igor. No, it's pronounced Igor. Oh, my God. I'm sure we'll get along splendidly. Oh, sorry. I, you know, I don't mean to embarrass you, but I'm a rather brilliant surgeon. Perhaps I could help you with that hump. Oh, my God. What hump? Uh... Let's go. No! <laughs> yeah, don't say that now! He said, oh my god! Oof! What was that? Oh, that will be Inga. Herr Falkstein thought you might need a laboratory assistant temporarily. Oof! Hello! Would you like to have a roll in the hay? Roll, roll, roll in the hay! Oh, roll in the... oh good lord. Werewolf. Werewolf? There. What? Werewolf. There. Castle. Why are you talking that way? I thought you wanted to. No, I don't want Oh, my God. Suit yourself. I'm easy. <laughs> what knockers. Oh, thank you, Doctor. Oh, my God. I am Frau Blucher. Inga, may I present Frau Blucher? Damn horses is like, mm mm. Your rooms have been prepared. Igor, uh, would you bring the bags as soon as you're finished, please? Yes, master. Are you really calling him Igor? Frau Blucher? <laughs> <laughs> they don't like her name or her, it seems like. Blucher! My goodness! And this is your room. It was your grandfather Victor's room. And where is my grandfather's private library? I don't know what you mean, sir. These books are all very general. This is the only library I know of, Dr. Frankenstone. Frankenstein. Oh, my God. <laughs> Good night, darling. Good night, Herr Doctor. Good night, Frau Blucher. <laughs> Hey, the horses. 
Some favorite here from back there. What's that strange music? I have no idea, but it seems to be coming from behind the bookcase. Behind the bookcase? The secret library you talked about? Hello? Oh, my gosh. It seems louder over here. Hand me that candle, will you? That's exactly what I was thinking. I was like, it's probably the dang candle. The candle back. <laughs> oh, boy. Take out the candle, and I'll block the bookcase with my body. Now listen to me very carefully. <laughs> Shove against the other side of the bookcase. Dang, so she's stuck back there now? Put the candles back! Oh my gosh! A passageway! Whatever that music is, it's coming from down there. I wonder what the whale said. Good Lord. Three years dead. Two years dead. Oh, that one looked worse than the three years. Six months dead. Oh, boy. Hi! <laughs> Froderick, how did you get here? Froderick. Aren't there any lights in this place? Two nasty looking switches over here, but I'm not going to be the first. Oh! Damn your eyes! Too late. Okay, they got a light, finally. I wouldn't have put that candle out, though. Well, it seems as if our mysterious violinist has disappeared. There is a light coming from behind that door. This explains the music. Well, who was playing it? But who was playing it? That's what I'm saying. Whoever it was just barely finished putting out his cigar. This is my grandfather's private library. I feel it. Change the poles from plus to minus, and oh. from minus... Hey, boy. I myself became capable of bestowing animation upon lifeless matter. It could work! Oh, my gosh. I resolved, therefore, to make the creature of a gigantic stature. Oh, boy. Of course. That would simplify everything. He would have an enormous Schwanstucker. Oh, my God. He's going to be very popular. That's good enough for the likes of him. Get down, you fool. be worse how what do you think was gonna happen oh my god Ooh. he ain't do that need a hand uh no thanks have one thanks very much oh my gosh oh boy can you account for yourself yes i am dr frederick frankenstein well I'm Constable Henry, sir. How very nice to meet you. You're chilled to the bone, sir. <laughs> A nice warm fire. <laughs> That's the ticket. Yeah. <laughs> Always. Oh, my gosh. Didn't you used to have that on the other side? What? Your, uh... Oh, my God. 
Oh, boy. Delbrook. Hans Delbrook. Oh, boy, Igor. Huh? Oh, gosh. Oh my goodness, what a fool. He is hideous. He's beautiful. <laughs> he is mine. I can't tell if that's Mel Brooks under there or not. Are you sure this is how they did it? Yes, yes, it's all written down in the notes. Can you imagine the brain of Hans Delbrook in this body? Frederick. This is the... Oh, girl. Are you ready? Yes, Doctor. Oh, gosh, you got the wrong idea ready. We shall ascend into the heavens. We shall mock the earthquake. Even though the brain switch. Go! Throw the third switch! Not the third switch. Throw it! Give my creation life! I don't know. Screaming gonna help. I mean... Oh, boy. It looks horrible. Turn everything off and bring me down! Because of that abnormal brain. Science teaches us anything. It teaches us to accept our failures as well as our successes. Son of a bitch bastard, I'll get you for this one! <laughs> what did you do to Stop me? This guy. <laughs> you killed him! He's already dead. the purpose of all that oh gosh a riot is an ugly zinc before we go around killing people we had better make them here of our evidence following in his grandfather's woodstuffs what following in his grandfather's woodstuffs <laughs> Oh, my God. Oh, oh, it's a shadow. Oh, okay, he's moving. Mm. Oh, do you like it? I'm not partial to desserts myself, but this... <laughs> you just made a yummy sound, so I thought you'd like the dessert. I didn't make a yummy sound. I just asked you what it is. But you did. I just heard it. It wasn't me. It wasn't me. If it wasn't you, when it wasn't you... Stand back. <laughs> Hello there. I'm going to set you free. Is the sedative ready? Yes, doctor. Maybe you should do that first before you just take him out. But he, the old boy, still didn't tell him about the abnormal brain. <laughs> Second syllable, liver 
It's like a uh, to give. Ted, uh, give. Give him a set again. Ted, set again. On the nosy. Oh, my God. After, like, all that time. What a joke. Set a give? <laughs> that brain that you gave me, was it Hans Delbrooks? No. Ah, good. Uh. Would you mind telling me whose brain I did put in? And you won't be angry? I will not be angry. Abby someone. Yes, he will. Abby who? Abby normal. Oh, my God. Are you saying that I put an abnormal brain into a seven and a half foot long, 54 inch wide gorilla? Is that what you're telling me? Idiot. Oh, my God. No, he did. Oh, my goodness. This is the 20th century camp. Monsters are passe, like ghosts and goblins. Not. It's a very real sink. Especially one. Oh, my God. Frankenstein residing in this house. Frankenstein. Uh-uh. <laughs> Transylvania. You are a Frankenstein. Oh, my gosh. You have no interest whatsoever in carrying on your grandfather's fork? Mm. May I take that for a yes? Mm. Very well. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, my God. Victor! We have done it! I'm going to set you free. Would you like that? Oh, my gosh. Frau Blucher! <laughs> <laughs> the horses. Are you insane? He'll kill you! No, he won't. He is as gentle as a lamb. <laughs> Stand back! I know what he likes. <laughs> Playing. Your grandfather used to play into the creature he was making. My gosh. You played that music in the middle of the night. Yes! To get us into the laboratory. Yes! That was your cigar smoldering in. <laughs> then you and Victor were. Yes! He was my boyfriend! <laughs> oh my god! Poor girl. Thank God you put Helga to bed. I was turning the roast, bra. I asked you to put Helga to... Now throw a kiss and say oh, bye-bye. Oh, being gentle. Oh, dear. Nothing left. What shall we throw in now? Maybe she was in the bathroom when you look. But, but, but I didn't look upstairs. I thought you did. You didn't look upstairs? My God, they are so all over the place. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Uh, a visitor is all I ask. A temporary companion to help me pass a few short hours in my lonely life. <laughs> Thank you. <Lord. laughs> At least you got a visitor. Mmm. Oh, no, 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 don't speak. Oh, you must have been the tallest one in your class. What is your name? Mm. I didn't get that. Mm. Mm. Nope. <laughs> I didn't realize you were mute. An incredibly big oh, mute. Boy. Are you ready for your soup? Mm. <laughs> oh, my friend, my friend. Mm. 
This is crazy. Sometimes in our preoccupation with worldly matters, <laughs> the simple pleasures. <laughs> the you know, oh my God, I would have left. A little wine with your soup, huh? A little wine. No, 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 no. <laughs> good, good. Long friendship. Oh my gosh. Cigars. <laughs> Fire is good. Fire is good. Yes, fire. See, so like, not for you. Oh my God, move your thumb. Where are you going? I was going to make espresso. No way. Oh no. We don't need nothing else for you, bro. No! Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Oh jeez. No matter how terribly I may scream, do not open this door or you will undo everything I've worked for. Oh my gosh. Everybody always say that and next thing you know they be begging. <laughs> Let me out. Let me out of here. Get me the hell out of here. <laughs> Jesus Christ, get me out of here! Mm. Open this goddamn door. I'll kick your rotten heads in. Mommy! Oh, my God. People hate you, but why do they hate you? Because they are jealous. Look at that boyish face. Look at that sweet smile. Do you want to talk about the Olympian ideal? You are a god! And listen to me. Oh my gosh. You are not evil. You are good! <laughs> <laughs> oh no. This is a good boy. <laughs> oh. We love him! <laughs> My name is Frankenstein! Oh, now it's Frankenstein. No Frankenstein now? What a joke. The reanimation of dead tissue. <laughs> what I have to offer you might possibly be the gateway to immortality. The creature! Please! I assure you, there is nothing to fear. Okay. From what was once an inarticulate mass of lifeless tissues, may I now present a cultured, sophisticated man about town. Hit it! Oh my God, I know you lying. Where to go to? <laughs> Different types who wear a Oh my goodness. Coat perfect fits. <laughs> Trying mighty hard to look like Gary Cooper. Cooper Cooper! Oh my goodness, what in the world? Oh my goodness! Oh boy. 
<laughs> Please, I beg you. Oh no. Come. Get him off of the stage. That's stupid. Oh my god. Oh god. Get away from the window. Your fiance will be arriving in a second. Elizabeth here tonight? I will go prepare her room at once. Oh my god. Surprise? Surprise. Love me? Love you. Well, let's turn in. She let him touch her hand. Surprise? I, uh, yes. Love me? Well. Well, let's turn oh in. God. I am a bit tired after all. I, I know it's you lying. Uh, well, I assist Dr. Frankenstein in the laboratory. As a matter of fact, we were just having fun as you were well, driving on. I, I go, would you give me a hand with the bag? Oh, my God, girl, be quiet. You take the blonde and I'll take the one in the terrible. table. I'm talking about the luggage. Yes, master. Oh my gosh. It's going to be a long night. If you need any help with the girls, please don't hesitate. <laughs> <Good job. laughs> I don't know if they want the help, but I don't know. <laughs> yeah, look, like you're the only one who's going to get hurt. <laughs> The whole time, a riot is an ugly thing. <laughs> Isn't that it is just about time that we had one? He's broken loose. Do you know what that means? You mustn't worry so. What would I do without you? Is your room just down the hall in case I get the fright during the night? Well, yes, but I, I thought perhaps tonight. Down the hall, y'all not sharing the room. Stay here with you. <laughs> Would you want me like this now? The soon before our wedding? Yes! Whoa! Oh, boy! <laughs> or? <laughs> wait, when I can be totally and unashamedly and legally yours. Unashamedly. A tough choice. You're a tough guy. I suppose you're right. Of course I am. I always am. No tongues. Oh, my God. Good night, darling. Mm -hmm. I love you. Mm -hmm. Good night and let the bed bugs mm -hmm. bye. Mm -hmm. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Oh, my gosh. What is it? What is it wrong with her? Where am I? What are you? What do you, what do you want? What do you want to do to me? Calm down. I'm not afraid of you. Oh my god, her hair. Speak! Speak! Why don't you speak? What are you doing? Oh my gosh. I'm, I'm, I'm engaged, and, and once he took. Oh, jeez, she's a freak. Oh my. Oh, oh. oh. I am life at last. I fall. <laughs> oh, I know the Oh, she liking that, honey. Well, I bet he cheated on her, so. My goodness. He took his girl. <sighs> All right. Seven has always been my lucky number. Mm. Oh, my gosh. What's the matter? Mm. They went six times. Nothing to worry about. Where are you going? Oh, you men are all alike. Seven or eight quick ones, and you're off with the boys. You better keep your mouth <laughs> shut. Oh, I think I love him. Oh my gosh. Oh, look, he's getting back. Oh, it's the music that's bringing him back. Girl, shut up. Oh, 
Shut up. Go! Ah! Ah! Don't ah! touch him! He wants to do it by himself! Mm. Do it. Ah! You can do oh, it! Keep playing! Have all the preparations been made for the transference? Yes, Doctor. Oh, boy. How, how will I know when they are done? The doctor said to allow 15 minutes, not one second more or less. How long now? Two more minutes. Eins, zwei! I know they lie with their arm. Dead man! Oh boy, I hope this doesn't mess up the time. They better lock that door and hold something in front of it. Good lord. Put that man down! It's the monster! I said put that man down! What just who do you think you are? That you ordered these people about. I am the monster! Oh my gosh. For as long as I can remember, people have hated me. They looked at my face and my body, and they ran away in horror. If I could not inspire love, which was my deepest hope, I would instead cause fear. <laughs> Poor, half-crazed genius has given me life. He used his own body as a guinea pig. Give me a calmer brain. May I be the first to offer you my hand in friendship? Thank you. You are entirely welcome. Oh, boy. And, and shit to the lumberyard! Oh, my gosh. Dee-dum, da-dum. Dee-dum, da-da-dum. Mrs. Frankenstein. Oh, he's alive. What a beautiful name. I'll be right back. <laughs> oh, no. Honey, I hope you didn't find Daddy's little party too boring. I mean, he did it just for you, and he meant so well. Say you liked it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Here I come. Oh, God. Oh, good Lord. Oh, no. There's something I've always wanted to ask you about that operation. The monster got part of your wonderful brain. But what did you ever get from him? Oh, God. <laughs> that movie was a hot mess. Oh my gosh. I feel like it was more comical. It wasn't scary at all. It was actually pretty funny. Um, I'm not surprised because of Mel Brooks. Like I said, I watched Blazing Saddles. Excuse me. And I like the way he approaches things like comedically. So I thought that I was just like, when I seen it, I'm like, I wonder if this is a comedy. If it's a comedy that I do, it's going to be good. That was good. That was funny. I enjoyed it. Um, I do want to ask, like, I don't know, Gene, why I feel like maybe they're really close or something. And I, I, I know it might be stupid for me to ask, and I probably sound dumb asking this. But was that, like, I was like, was the, was he Mel Brooks? Because I only seen Mel Brooks playing um, Blazing Saddle for a bit. Everybody told me in the comments that was Mel Brooks, and I had no idea. So I can't really remember his face too much. Um, but I was kind of curious. I'm like, was that him? But I might be wrong. I don't know. Um... I probably don't know what I'm talking about. Like I said, I don't really remember Mel Brooks' face. I kind of, after that, I kind of just kind of held on more to the name, you know? But overall, this was a, this movie was funny. It definitely was something else. Uh, it was a hot mess, especially when he was over here trying to tell them the sedative. They, they sit over here, um, is it three by, I'm like, oh my God, he was getting toe up over there. And they talk about, they over here trying to play charade. 
Jeez, that was a hot mess. Igor, aka Igor. It was a whole lot. And then at the end, I guess he didn't want to be Frankenstein. He wanted to be Frankenstein. So uh, that was interesting. So far, like I said, this was a funny movie. Uh, comment down below your favorite uh, moments watching this. And also, what was your experience when you first seen it? Did you guys like kind of feel like me being like, oh my God? Or was you guys like, you know, more laughing? Or how did you feel about the movie? Did you like the movie? Like I said before, to see the whole watch along, it is going to be on my Patreon link down below, so go ahead and check it out. I love you guys. Um, I'm going to go ahead and jump off of here, and I hope you guys have a great day. And remember, happy Fiddlestick in October. So, I'll see you soon.